Welcome back to another live here with Design Bundles. Today is the day. It is the dollar deal that we all wait for all month long. Today is our famous dollar deal. And if you guys don't know what that is, we'll definitely dive into that in just a second. So today I'm going to show you guys three projects out of these 42 designs. And we will be giving away all 42 designs. We'll do a giveaway at the end, so make sure you guys stay tuned. So let's go ahead and dive right in. All right, so first off, let me go ahead and tell you the theme that I went with today. Today we went with hashtag baby. So if you guys use that hashtag baby in the comments below, you can have a chance to win all 42 designs from today's dollar deal and they are good ones. You don't want to miss it. So if you are the lucky winner at the very end, you're gonna be able to craft with all 42 designs today. So um, let's go ahead and go over. Like I said, we're doing baby theme. So I've got a Glowforge project here I've already completed and I'm going to talk about. And then I've got a Cricut project here. And then I've also got a sublimation project. So let's go ahead and jump on over to designbundles.net. I'm going to show you the files that are included today. Now, um, I want to go ahead and also say, as you guys are joining in, I want to know where are you guys crafting from? I want to know what are you guys after? Is it the SVGs? Is it the PNGs? Um, is it some of the fonts? I want to know what is your most favorite one. So if you guys have a favorite one out of here, if it's signs, if it's t-shirt stuff, drop it down below because I want to know what is your favorite. Also, once again, the hashtag today is hashtag baby. Use it in the comments below for a chance to win at the very end. Also, we will be doing Q&A as usual. So if you have any questions along the way, um, we will definitely get to those at Q&A. All right, so there is a ton of designs as usual, but there is a lot of amazing ones. Not that there's not always, but these are some of my absolute favorites. You guys do not want to miss it. I feel like this is the dollar deal of all dollar deals. So number one, I want to start off with this one right here. So this bundle includes 20 designs. So have you guys seen those amazing baby signs that are being made over there on Instagram? So I'm going to show you guys my finished project here in just a minute. This is those projects. You could create these with the wood and then add the acrylic on top. Um, you could create these using your Cricut if you wanted to. You could actually buy the wood rounds and then you can use like heavy chipboard and things like that. So lots of different things you can do, not just with laser machines. You can still pull this off. Now, the amazing thing about this one is this is originally $55, y'all. Trust me, I purchased this whenever it first came out. I had to have it when all of those signs started trending, and I hadn't had a chance to make one until now. But it's $55. Today, you're going to get it for a buck. So if you buy any anything today, let it be this one. And um, even if you don't have a laser and that's what you're wanting to use it, put it in the stockpile. Save this guy for later. So highly recommend. That's one of my favorites. We have mega keychain bundles here, several different ones to choose from. You can see over 170 plus files here. Um, we've got some really fun sublimation files. This one's really cute. You guys know these are my favorites. Um, we've actually got a couple tutorials out. Um, so this one is for the Tooth Fairy. You, um, it has those little um, plastic inserts that you do for these ones. So cute. So we do have those. Um, we've got some gnome stuff. This one right here I'm going to be using today. So we're going to be sublimating and I'm going to let you guys choose which way we're going to do it. So we're going to do this one very last today. It's really cool because it comes with a lot of elements. Now, I get questions all of the time is what can we do with these clip arts? You can sublimate with them. You can make stickers with them. You can do the printable vinyl. I mean, the list goes on. You can use them in Procreate if you wanted to. All sorts of fun things that you can do with these. So um, don't just think of sublimation or stickers. Lots and lots of fun stuff there. We have some massive craft bundles. So these are bundles huge bundles for a dollar inside of these things. Um, let's see here, scrolling through. We have some stuff here too. So 4th of July is coming up right around the corner. If you guys need some last minute designs, $1. So we have some really cool ones here. As you guys can see here, look at how super cute this one is. You have stuff for monograms. I really love this washed out look here as well. Super stinking cute designs. I love, love, love all of these. And they're all going to be $1 for the entire bundle. So if if you guys are new here, let me pause for just a second. If you guys are new to our dollar event and you're wondering how does this thing work, 
So here in about, let's see if I can scroll up here. So here in about 52 minutes, you guys are going to go in here and purchase. You're going to be able to purchase these. Now, what you're going to do is it no longer will say after party. You're going to be able to now... The only way you have an after heart party is if you are a plus member. So if you are one of our plus members, you actually do have access to our after party. So if you don't, you're going to see a different little button here that says add to cart. So you're going to be able to add these to your cart and check out. Now make sure within that window that you check out because if you don't completely check out, you're going to lose them. So make sure you check out. And then when you check out, sometimes we have extra goodies there as well. So that's how that's going to work. And then you can download them whenever you want. Don't feel like you have to download them today. Come back whenever and download them as many times as you need to. So moving right along here, we have some really fun layer projects too that you can do with paper crafts, um, you know, wood, all sorts of fun stuff. We have some really fun fishing ones, you know, it's summertime, make some of those fun t-shirts for yourself, hoodies. I mean, the list goes on. We also have some stuff here too for the Libby glasses. So I was really excited about this one because if you watched a couple of our lives backwards for the dollar deal, uh, me and Michael actually did this with the color changing vinyl. So um, it's gorgeous. So I highly recommend y'all check this one out as well because you guys know those are trending. We have a huge Tumblr bundle here, 379 designs for $1. So you guys can check that out here. So stinking cool. Lots and lots of those. And then we've got sticker stuff. We've got more Glowforge things. Um, if you are a plant fanatic like me, we have stuff here for gardening. These would be great for signs, t-shirts, all that. Even some farmhouse stuff. I really love these for tea towels and all that. So another one that we are using today is this one right here. It's really cool because you can create those uh, milestones. So we are going to be doing that. Is it milestones? I think Is it baby milestones? You guys correct me down below if I'm saying it wrong. But um, you guys, I, I guess, it says milestones right here. So um, you can create acrylics like this. That's what we're doing today. You could throw these on a baby onesie. So you can make 12 onesies if you wanted to. Um, all sorts of fun stuff. But it comes with these little wreaths and all these pieces and all of these little tiny things you need. So you can see it there with a onesie. So I also highly recommend you snag that guy for a buck. Sticker stuff, like I said, lots and lots of goodies here. Um, and then also we have another door sign one, as you can see here. So I'll kind of quickly scroll through here showing you a couple of these so this is another one that i would highly recommend that you guys snag and then we have fonts as well so as you can see this is a really big bundle here this is the perfectly cut font bundle a dollar so 20 fonts here this is where i always love to come in and snag a lot of my fonts and stockpile those as well um mandela stuff lots and lots of goodies all right so now that we've went through this let's go ahead and go over the projects that we're making today so let's go and drop this screen down really quick and we'll head on over to our projects. All right, so let's start off with the Glowforge. Once again, hello for you guys that are joining. I'm so, so excited about this dollar deal. If you guys are excited as well, make sure you guys hit that uh, like button down below so I know you guys are just as excited as me. If you guys have seen, like I said, make sure I'm showing this correctly, those huge signs over on Instagram, they've been trending for quite some time. Let me explain how I did this. I use MDF number one, and I have it linked below where I like to purchase mine. I get them for $2.50 a sheet. It took me two sheets to do this. Now, the big wood round, you could definitely, it comes with a circle. It comes included in the files. So you could cut your own circle. And depending on which Glowforge you have, if you have the Pro, you could cut a bigger circle. But what I actually did with this circle, this is really thick. This is plywood. I purchased this from Ho Hobby Lobby. It's that Woody Pie brand. They're $16.99. But normally they have them around 50, I'm trying to make sure I have it straight, around 50 to 40% off. So I got it around $7.50 or so. You can usually find these even at like your hardware store. And another thing that I would recommend, say for example, you have a basic Glowforge or a laser machine, you can accomplish cutting because I cut all these pieces out and not the wood round because mine would not cut it this big, right? You can buy one of those. I want to say it's a rotary tool. You guys let me know down below which would be the correct tool, but I want to say it would be, is it a rotary tool or a router? 
It may be a router. Anyways, you can buy some plywood and you can make your own circles and then cut these pieces out with your laser. Now, another thing that you could accomplish, once again, you can use a heavy chipboard or something like that. So you can accomplish just with your Cricut. You can use some of that uh, wood that you would be able to pull off with the Cricut makers and things like that. So once again, whether you have a laser machine right now or not for a dollar, I would grab this guy today. It's normally $55 for this bundle. Like I said, ask me how I know because I've definitely paid for it. So this guy right here is amazing. I love it. This is just one. So there's 20 different ones, tons of stuff for boys and girls. There's farm stuff. So stinking cute. I am obsessed. But anyway, so what I did, I cut these out with the MDF two sheets. When I cut them out, I kept them inside of, um, the piece of MDF, if you will. And then I went in and painted these. I used a mixture between chalk paint and acrylic. It was just what I had on hand. Some colors I didn't have, like this brown right here, I mixed yellow and purple to come up with this brown. So I just really played with it. This right here is linen from StarCraft. This is their chalk paint, um, just all sorts of fun things. Now, tip from me, when you do this, make sure you paint. So before you obviously glue it down, paint the edges. So that burn mark from the laser, make sure you guys paint those edges. And that's just going to complete it. It looks gorgeous. And what I did was I just used the name that was in, included, but you can delete that name, put your own name in there. So you can definitely do that. Now, the really cool thing is once I was done, I needed a circle because I have linked down below some acrylic circles. So if y'all don't have a laser, I've linked some down below for you. But if you guys actually have a Glowforge for your next project or laser, you can cut out your own acrylic circles. So that's what I did. And I used the circle from here. So to move on to my next project, I just deleted everything but the circle and I used it for this. So just another little tip there. And then in Glowforge, if you use um, copy and paste from your uh, keyboard, if you will. Um, you can copy and paste and make multiples. And that's how I did that. But either way, this was made with a glow forge. You guys let me know down below. What do you guys think about my sign? I'm obsessed with it. And I'll drop it down so you guys can see it a little bit closer, but this is just one. Now also on Instagram, if you guys know what I'm talking about, there's like these little metal pieces. Don't ask. I don't know what they're called, but people are putting the acrylic on top. You could do that to finalize it and create that. But this is the bundle. I'm telling y'all, I want to know, raise your hand, put a hand in the comments. Who is snagging this today? All right. So that is one. And then we're going to move on and I'm going to show you guys our next one because the next one, we're going to be making these acrylics here. These are the baby milestones. So let me show you how we did it. So I'm going to drop our camera down below. There we have it. So cute. Look at how adorable this is. Those colors and everything. I'm going to kind of bring it up so hopefully y'all can see how 3D this thing is. It is so stinking cute. I love, love, love the way it came out. I am obsessed. And I painted the edges of this too. And once again, this is just plywood. So you can cut your own and then cut all of these pieces out. So absolutely love the way this one came out. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and scoot this guy up a little bit, up and over. And now I'm going to bring these in so y'all can see them. All right, so here are our baby milestones. Let me slide them in here really quick. And then we're gonna make our last two. So here we go. So now I got inspiration. Actually, Brittany is the one that brought it to my attention. Somebody in our Facebook community group had made these the other day using a metallic um, adhesive vinyl. So we recreated it today because you guys absolutely loved it. Now, if you guys are not a part of our Facebook community group, make sure you guys join. I'm sure it's in the comments or the description below. We have 45 remaining guys, 45 minutes. All right. So what I did here, let me go ahead and explain. All right. So we've got our acrylic blanks. Once again, if you have a laser, cut your own. If not, I have them linked down below. These are four inches. And what I did was I took some, this is navy blue i use folk art in case you guys want the exact numbers 403 i use this acrylic paint on one side i didn't take off one paper so that way i didn't get any any stuff on that i only took off the one side another thing you can also use is chalk paint they have starcraft has it in navy gorgeous i have all of these things linked down below the one thing about chalk paint is it is a lot more easier to kind of scratch up over time where acrylic is going to hold up better but chalk paint will dry a lot faster okay all right so let's start off i'm going to scoot some of these guys out of our way here i'm going to bring in a piece of parchment so that way you can get ready to paint this. So what I'm going to do, like I said, I've only pull, pulled, I pulled off, peeled off, pulled off one side of that um, protective cover there. 
And so now we're gonna go ahead and take some of our paint here and then I just used a little foam brush. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna shake it up. I'm gonna get a little bit here on the side that way I can use it to paint. And a little goes a long way. I may need a little bit more, so we'll keep it open. And I just got mine up here and I'll probably get paint on my hands. So for the rest of the show, I'm gonna have painted hands. All right, so what we're gonna do is I just went over this. Now I had to paint mine twice. So I just got a grip of this. Let me actually get a little bit more on here. So I just went ahead and went over the entire thing, laid it flat in my hands and just painted the whole one side. Like I said, I had to paint it twice. So I got all my strokes trying to get those all in one direction like that. So once you have it painted like this, you're simply gonna go ahead and set it out of the way, let it completely dry. When it's dry, come back and paint it one more time. Now, because the um, luxury of TV, as they used to say back in the day, we're gonna scoot that guy out of our way and we have our painted. So once you put in that second coat, it's gonna look like this. So at this point, we're gonna peel off this side here. Now, if you guys are just not joining, you guys can watch this on the replay, but keep in mind, if you guys are not a plus member, you guys only have one hour to completely check out. And if you guys are a plus member, you guys have an extra 24 hours. So even if you become a plus member today, you're still going to have access to that after party. So in case you guys are wondering. All right, so now we're going to put it on this side, not the painted side, but this side. And I've got my design right here. So what I did over in Cricut Design Space was I just pieced these pieces together. And I used one of the wreaths as well as the number, obviously, and then months. And then we are going to go ahead and take a piece of transfer. How gorgeous is this? So we're doing a baby thing because you guys know baby showers are coming up. I'm super ready for fall. Who is ready for fall weather? If you're ready for fall weather, give me a leaf in the comments below. It is my favorite time of year. So I'm counting down the days and I have lots of projects for y'all. So y'all stay tuned. All right. So we're going to go ahead and take our squeegee. All right. Take our squeegee here. And also in the comments, does anybody have any upcoming babies, baby showers that they're going to? This would make the perfect gifts, y'all. Perfect item to sell um, as well as gift or make for yourself. So now what we're doing is I'm going to try to get this in the middle a little bit more so y'all can see. And then so now what I'm going to do is I'm just hovering above. You can definitely use the parchment paper trick to make sure it's absolutely perfect. And then we're going to go ahead and squeegee this down. Now I did try... Um, to use a glitter. Um, I tried to use a glitter adhesive vinyl, but my line right here is too thin and it just would not weed good enough for me. So I use this metallic gold and blue and it's gorgeous. Y'all let me know what you guys think. I love these colors. And just like that, it is that easy to make these. So if you purchase these or you make them on your own, I mean, you're looking at a couple bucks to make these. It really does not cost much and they are gorgeous, like I said, so stinking cute. You can do whatever colors you wanted to. So whatever theme you guys have going on, you can definitely pull that off. All right, so let me go ahead and let's go ahead. I'm gonna pop you guys back up here really quickly. And we are gonna move on to our last project. I think you guys are getting down to around 30 minutes or so, and I wanna make sure y'all have enough time to run over there and get what you need. So the next project we are doing is a, we're gonna sublimate a tumbler. This is a kid's tumbler. I have it linked down below. I recommend checking out JP Plus because that's the cheapest I found it. They're around $10.50. On Amazon, they're around $14. So no matter where we have our links, you guys make sure y'all find the best deal. So we have tried to do that and that's where we found these. So there's two different colored tops. And what I always try to do is I try to color coordinate them because there's one for boys and there's one for girls or whichever way you wanna do these. All right, so step one, we wanna go ahead and remove our lid. And before you even turn on your tumbler press, by the way, I'm using the Keep Press Nation Signature Series. And if you guys didn't know, we actually gave one of these away the other day. So make sure you guys are following that Facebook group. Um, you wanna go ahead and test it. So before I turn it on and get it too to get it hot, I always test that pressure. So I've already done that and I have it 365 for 70 seconds. Now, once again, if I'm going quick for y'all, you can definitely watch this on the replay and I'm gonna be answering some questions here in a minute. All right, so this is where you guys get to chime in. I have two designs here and I'm gonna drop y'all down so hopefully y'all can see them a little better. 
All right, so we have option number one. So we can either do this one today. This is super cute. It's already designed out for you. It actually has a whole other dinosaur here, but I sized it out for our Tumblr. So it comes with an entire one like this, or you could create your own designs, or you can bring them in individual. So what I did was I brought in one of the cute dinosaurs here, and I wrote out Piper Jean with a little bit of shadow. And on the shadow, it's the color that it's on his spikes. Now, remember with sublimation, once we press these, the colors are going to be super vibrant. This is option number two. So should I press option number two or option number one? Do we want to check out all those fun colors? You guys let me know. Start sounding down below option one or option two. So I'm going to go ahead and let y'all chime in for just a minute. And I think we're down to around 23 minutes or so. Y'all let me know. I think we can get a clock out here to see two. So option one or option two. I'm seeing number two coming in. I'm seeing some number ones. Um, I'm super, super excited for this one. Number one, I really think number one's got it going on. I don't know. I see some twos, ones. All right. Let's see here. I think we got more ones going on. So let's go ahead and roll with it, which is here. And so what I'm going to do now is take my paper trimmer. Now, if y'all are wondering, how did I get this like this? I actually did it in Canva. You can use Canva. You can, if you're a gold plus member, you can use, um, our software, designscape uh, to create this. So I actually plugged in the number, so now I can just trim around it. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I'm gonna move these guys out of my way so we can be ready to do this. So let me go ahead and trim this down and then I'll drop you guys back down while we get ready to prep this tumbler. I'm like, why is this not sitting? Oh, I see it. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, I had to think for a second what I was doing. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and trim off the excess. And then we're gonna need some heat tape here. So I'm gonna grab that in just a second. All right. I love these kids tumblers. They are adorable. They're one of my absolute favorites. Um, so here we go. And you can do the same thing if you wanna use like a 20 ounce tumbler or anything like that. Coffee mugs, so stinking cute. These aren't just for kids. I love these dinosaurs. Did anybody ever watch that when you were a kid? What was the name? Y'all drop it down below. What was the name of that dinosaur cartoon? I loved it. I was obsessed, but then I'm funny. I can't even remember the name. Is it Land of the Land of the Lost something? All right. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to get a few things here. I've got a clean cloth, I've got my tweezers for in a minute, and I've got my heat gloves. So let's go ahead and remove any sort of lint or debris. I need to play with the designscape. I haven't tried it yet. I'm telling you, I am obsessed. I love it, Tammy. All right, so we're just cleaning this really, really quick. And we're gonna get us two pieces of tape just to start with. Put this one down here for a sec. And then we're going to wrap this. Just make sure you obviously wrap it in the correct direction. So I think you guys can see everything from this angle. So what I'm going to do is center this guy up. And the rule that I teach is I normally say don't overlap, but I'm going to overlap it today just a smidge. All right, so I'm going against my own rules. So we're going to go ahead and tape that center. You just want to make sure it's nice and tight. You can always look at your bottom piece here as well as your top. Just make sure they're nice and tight. And then I'm going to go ahead and get another one at the top here. And then let's get one more on here. We'll pop it in. All right, let's see here. With the baby dinosaur, they said, not the mama. To oh, my gosh, I love that. I watched it all of the time. I love that one. And you know what's funny is I think it's either on Netflix or Hulu. So you can go back and watch it. And it's weird when you're an adult how stuff doesn't seem like it was when you were a kid. Like, I love watching the Flintstones, too. All right, so here we go. We're going to have to rotate this twice. So we're going to go ahead and pop it in. I'll start here. I'm going to get it in the middle of my tumbler. I'm going to press it. And so in the meantime, while we are pressing this, um, I was going to say, let's go ahead and just pop back over to, uh, let's share the screen again for um, design bundles. That way we can go over some more of these designs. So let's do that while we're waiting today. All right. So jumping back over here, let's go ahead and show some of the ones I haven't already showed, or if you guys are just now joining, these are some of the 42 designs that we have today. Once again, use that hashtag baby for a chance to win. So we have some really fun ones here. These are some funny quotes. I've done these ones before and I absolutely love them. These would be great for bleach t-shirts um, and all of that kind of stuff. Once again, you can use it on coffee cups and all of that. So if my mouth doesn't say it, 
my face sure will. I love that one. Let's see, with these gnomes, let's check in with these ones here. It looks like we have a lot of stuff for different holidays. So it looks like we have summer stuff, Valentine's, you know, Christmas. It's It's got tons and tons of stuff in here. Some super, super, oh, look at these really cute ones for the camping. So stinking cute. I wanted to check these guys out. These would be perfect for creating some fun signs. I also think these would be cute um, to put on some little jars and things like that. All right, so we're going to rotate this really quick. So let me go ahead and grab my glove. And I'm just going to go ahead and rotate this guy. There we go. Pop that back down, and then we'll keep on going through here. All right, so um, like I said, these would also be really cute to put on, because um, it says, if when life gives you lemons, make lemonade, or it says, when life gives you lemons, add vodka. How stinking cute would these be on um, some of those sublimatable um, wine glasses and stuff like that? Those would be so cute, too. So highly recommend y'all check these out. So, so stinking cute. This one right here, I think would be amazing to create those t-shirts. Um, you see how it's on a black t-shirt and you're like, well, how can we accomplish that? You can use Caesar Easy Subly. You can use printable HTV and all of those kind of things. So let's go and jump in some more of those um, 4th of July stuff. Look at this right here for the toddler tees, all sorts of fun stuff here. So stinking cute. Um, love, love, love this one. Just trying to quickly go through here. Lots of different little fonts that you guys can create as you've seen there keychains so much fun stuff i love these such a great gift for somebody or once again make them for yourself last minute stuff guys we got um, mega bundles here so as you can see in here look at all these fun designs so it looks like we have lots of different patterns these would be great for sublimation all right so let's go ahead and switch back over here and we'll check out our tumbler now what i'm going to use let me grab it is I always tell this is what I recommend. I would grab, and you can grab an off-brand one, but Cricut has that eight by 10 pad. And I use this one, you can use any of the sizes, but I use these to grab these out to keep it from, to protect my table, if you will. They're heat resistant. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and pop this guy out here. I'm gonna grab my other glove and I'm gonna go and turn this off. So I think we got, can we get a clock on here? I think we've probably got around, around 20 minutes. So we're going to get ready to, we're going to wrap this guy up and then we're going to get ready for Q&A. So let's go ahead and peel off our tape. There we have it. So stinking cute. And then we're going to check out that seam. Oh my gosh, I love this. But let me go ahead and drop this down so I can show you guys. So you guys can see a better view if I can push my button. There we have it. Look at how adorable. You guys chose a really good one. So this was option number one I was showing you guys. So here is our seam here, as you guys can see. So cute. Look at those dinosaurs. Are those are adorable. You could throw these on t-shirts. Caesar Easy Subly. You could, um, you know, use a printable vinyl, throw these on coffee mugs, all sorts of fun stuff. But I can see these on tote bags, lunch boxes, you name it, this is so, so cute. So you can throw these on. Um, so this would be more like a toddler. So we've got like our toddler cups here. So I'm gonna let this guy cool down. And so I'm gonna bring y'all up. This was option number two. So you guys can see that dinosaur there and then just add a name, which I would cut these separate and put them on. But that came out super, super cute. 30 minutes left to the dollar deal. I'm going to bring you guys back over here while we let this cool down. You want to let it completely cool down before you pop on that lid. Uh, we'll go ahead and get ready for Q&A. <music> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and scooch this guy over. We're going to swap it with our mouse pad so we can go ahead and get ready for our Q&A. Let's see what questions you guys have for me today. So we have Chris, and she says, good question. How ex easily do you think the can glass wraps could be to adapt for other types of glasses? Um, the glass, yes, yeah, so the glass wraps, you can definitely throw those. If you mean like changing those over to like a coffee cup or a tumbler, if I'm thinking this correctly, um, it would be definitely very easy. All right, let's see here. Do you have, um, do you have to purchase store credits to get the dollar bundle? You do not. Um, all you have to do is add them to your cart. But once again, make sure you check out within that hour window. Um, once again, if you're a plus member, you're going to get the extra 
um, you're going to get the extra time, but you do not have to have store credits. Does this come in SVG and PNG also? So if you're talking about this one here, it only comes in the PNG version. So make sure you pay attention to your files today because a lot of them come in PNG or SVG. I have a tutorial coming very soon. I recorded it the other day. So if you guys have a silhouette, I showed you guys how to convert a PNG to an SVG. So keep an eye out for that. All right, I missed it. What is the circle made of? So the circles here, if you're talking about these, these are acrylic. And if you're talking about our great big sign, I'm gonna show you just in case you're just now getting in here. If you're talking about this, this is actually plywood. Now I purchased it from Hobby Lobby, so locally, and it was $16.99, but I get it when it's either, it was either 40 or 50, 40 or 50%. So if it's 50%, around $7.50. But it's definitely just plywood, so you can cut your own using your rotor whatever it would be. Is it rotor? You guys let me know. I don't know if you guys already answered that below, but if that's what you're wondering, that's what that is. And if you're talking about these, it is acrylic. So we have everything linked down below except for that plywood. All right, let's see here. Question, if I press the dyno onto a 12 ounce kid's tumbler, can I add a name later? Yes. So if you punch, if you punch, if you put the dyno on there, yes, you can go back, add that name, press it again. And another thing is too, I like to do is sublimate one and then add the name with vinyl. You can definitely do a combo as well. All right, let's see here. Is the dollar deal today or tomorrow? It is today. It actually starts here in about 20 minutes or so. So make sure as soon as we're done with this live, you head straight over to designbundles.net. We have links for you in case you need them. All right, let's see. Will it tell me if I order all of them, if I've already purchased some previously? So Rosie, there's actually a way to show. Um, I may let, um, I don't know, because I think we've got, because Brittany's helping run our live again today. So we've got a ghetto. We have Dawn, we have Brittany. Somebody in the comments below I know can help that with there because I know there is a way to see what you've purchased. All right, let's see. How can you do this project without investing um, lots of money in a press? You can actually, good question. So you can actually use your convection oven. If you have one, you can purchase something that is called Subla Shrink. So it just goes right into that and it shrinks around it. And you can grab those for about five bucks on Amazon. And um, so that's another way to do it. Um, and I feel like there was one more. What did we do? Because we did the convection. Um, there's some, if you have a, if you already have like a mug press that it would fit in, there's ways that people are hacking. So stay tuned. I've got a video coming um, of your Cricut mug press, if you have one of those as well. So, um, but I would recommend if you have a convection oven, um, getting the little Subla shrink and you can do that too. All right, let's see here. What tumbler press are you using? This is the tumbler press from Heat Press Nation. This is their signature series. It's the seven in one. So it does all sorts of stuff all the way down to a shot glass. But you can purchase this where it's just the tumbler press and not all the other stuff. All right, let's see. Is Canva good to use for the clip art building um, people's <laughs> building people bundles? I actually use this to do. I did this in Canva. So yes, yes, yes. Let's see, how do I purchase the Dollar Deal newbie here? So what you're going to do is, um, let's go ahead and pop open that screen one more time. Here we go. So let's say, for example, it was live and active. You're going to see where it says add to cart. So you're going to have a, see, like right now it says we have 25 minutes to go. It's going to tell you once it turns to the Dollar Deal, it's going to say you have 30 minutes left or whatever it is. But what you're going to do is you're just going to click add to cart. Once you get all those in your cart, you're just going to pop up to your cart and check out as usual, but make sure you do it within that hour window. Once again, if you're new, you do not have to download it right away. So you can come back and download it. Once you have an account created, you can come back years from now and do it. Um, so don't feel like you have to do it today and you can come back and re-download as many times as you want in case you change computers or you need it again. So uh, we store it here for you. So no rush, uh, but definitely just make sure you check out right away. But yes, you're just going to add the cart. You can add all of those um, just like so. And once again, once you check out, you may get a few more extra free, not freebies because you still have to pay for them, but a few extras pop up there at the end. Um, and also, if you are new, if you are a Plus member and you still join today, you still have access, you will get a whole 24 hours. So you see how mine says after party member? You only see that if you're a Plus member. So if you're a Plus member, yours will say after party because I have a whole 24 hours to make up my mind. Whereas if you're not, you have one hour. 
So hopefully you guys find that helpful. All right, let's see here. You don't wrap anything around the tumbler before you press it. I do not. So when I first started, and by the way, we can pop on our lid. When I first started doing this and really getting into sublimation, um, I was wrapping it with parchment paper and all that because I thought I really needed to protect this. I even did it with a Cricut press, still getting in there. But now I have found it does not bleed through. Now, depending on what printer, say for example, you're using an Epson, you may be getting too much ink saturation, um, infusible ink and things. So depending on what printer you're using, you may or may have, may or may not have to. I use the Sawgrass and I definitely don't have to. All right, let's see here. Can you share more about the Plus membership? So the Plus membership, and actually, if you give me a second, let me log out really quick before I share my screen. Let me go ahead and log out here. And that way I can show you if I wasn't somebody. So let me go ahead and share my screen again. All right, give me two seconds. Here we go. Perfect. So right here, and this is something amazing. So you can join Plus today for um, for a month. I think it's, is it for a dollar? Yeah, for just a dollar. For one dollar, you guys can sign up today. So what you're going to do, say that you're just now getting here, even if you're logged in. I'm not logged in because I actually have one, so it wouldn't show me. So if you're new, you're going to come to where it says join now right here on the front screen. And then you're going to see, it's going to talk about it and all that kind of give you some information. We actually have three tiers. So we have the bronze membership, which is $7.99. We have the gold membership, which I highly recommend. It's $18.99. And then we have the silver membership, which is $11.99. And then um, I'm going to go ahead and show you here really quickly. We have 10%. So if you are a bronze or a silver, both of those, you get 10% off of all of your purchases. And then the gold membership, you get 15. And that includes the dollar deal. So I get mine, somebody do the math for me. Um, is it nah, is it 85 cents that I get it? So instead of a dollar, um, I get 15% off of um, each of those. Um, you have a print, print on demand, so you could actually send it through so you can print these things out through a company, all sorts of different things that you guys get with it. But you get access with these to the dollar deal. So that's how that works. But like I said, you can try out right now for one buck. And if you don't like it, you can definitely cancel. So you have an entire month to try it out for one buck. So make sure you guys definitely check that out. But if you come down to these tiers, each one, like I said, tells you. So for example, the bronze, you're going to get 10 credits because we have a plus um, area that has all of these files, lots and lots of files. I'll actually give you guys a sneak peek really quick if you're not a member, but um, you have 10 credits each month and they use, they build. They don't go anywhere. They're going to continue to build. I have like 300 something built up. Um, and then I have, you get 50 of them with the gold plus. I always highly recommend the gold because you get access to our designscape. You get the 15% off. So say, for example, if I was paying 55 bucks for that, I would get that 15% off. So just stuff to keep in mind, and there's also lots and lots of extras. So let me go ahead and I'll drop my screen really quick. Let me go ahead and do that. And I'm going to try to sign back in just so I can show you guys. So give me just a minute. I'm going to go back to keep shopping. Give me two seconds. And then um, let's see here. I'm going to go ahead and give me a second. I'll log back in here. Let me do my security piece here. Next, let's see if that got me back in there. Nope, give me a second. You know how you guys have to confirm just so nobody can take your stuff? That's what I was trying to do really quick. Hopefully this will get me back in. Perfect. All right, so let me go over to the plus area. There we go. Now let me share my screen one more time. I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek. So if you guys are not a plus member and you guys wanna see inside of here, this is our plus membership area. So with those tiers, like I said, the lower ones, you have 10 uh, credits every month and they continue to add. If you are um, gold, you have 50 credits a month. And if you come in here, look at this, you have 181 612 results, but you can narrow it down. So if you're into sublimation or so you can go to crafters and they're really narrow, but we have so many designs in here, lots and lots of stuff. And it's, I consider it like free. Look at this one. I'm going to have a tutorial coming because I think this is so cute. It's technically free is how I see it. Cause you have 50 credits. I have 50 things I can get for free. Um, and it's so it's right here. So it's like, well, well, aren't you just a fun little lollipop, uh, tried Triple dipped in cycle. I don't know. I think it's super stinking cute. But anyways, that's just a little sneak peek right in there. Lots and lots of stuff. Um, so I'll go ahead and back back out of there really quick. So do we have any other questions? Let's see here. 
how do the two keychain bundles differ? So we can go ahead and go back over to the dollar deal really quickly and we can peek into them really fast. So let's go ahead and go into the mega one here. So we've got some patterns in here. It looks like we have the brush strokes. This one is so stinking cute. Oh my gosh, this gives me like the 80 vibes. So stinking cute. That will be added to cart. Okay, so you can see some of those there. So the next bundle here, if you come into it, you can see that we've got some different stuff. Let's see if this, let me try to exit back out of there and see if it gives me, I think it's kind of just giving me this one, but you can see the different patterns that it has. So we have even like cow print. So we definitely have totally different patterns than we have in the other one. So definitely two different keychain bundles there. Um, and then let's see if we have any more questions. Let's see. What else do we have here? Do all of the files come with a commercial license? So I do believe I'll let them answer it in the comments below, but I do want to say... I, no, you know what? I don't want to say that. I know that our plus member, all of those come with a commercial license, but I don't want to answer that because I'm not 100% sure. So I'll let them do that down below. But if you are a plus member, you do have commercial license to all of our plus stuff. All right, let's see, where do you get the blanks from? So as for these blanks here, I made mine with my Glowforge, but you can definitely purchase them on Amazon. I have them linked down below um, and you can even get them in different sizes. So the one that I've linked, you can get them in six inches or whatever. These are four inch acrylic circle blanks. All right, let's see. What size tumbler press do you recommend from Heat Press Nation? So they actually have, um, they may have a 20 ounce and a 30 ounce. That may be what you're referring to. Um, I would go for the 20 ounce. And if you decide that you're going to do 30 ounce tumblers, then you can downgrade. I think you could possibly, I have, if y'all want me to test it, I have the 30 ounce tumbler attachment. We can make sure the 20 ounce will still go in there because then at that point, I recommend to do that as well. All right, let's see here. Do you go through a lot of ink fast doing sublimation? Honestly, I don't. You would be surprised of how much ink I've purchased. I've been doing sublimation, I want to say since 2016, 17. It's been quite some time. And I've been using a sawgrass from the beginning. That's just the one I highly recommend. It doesn't clog. The ink is really good. And you have a tool that helps you with that saturation and all that on your paper um, for the product that you're doing. And so um, I have not. I know they're pricey individual. Every time you have to purchase, one but if a group black goes out you replace the black not all of them and it does last a very very long time i've only replaced my inks a couple times over this time all right let's see here when you purchase all of these files always available with a monthly fee i think i joined before but not quite sure if i'm still active you can always tell if you're active because it'll say after party if yours says after party member then you are active so that's just a way that you can always tell and if not you can definitely reactivate your membership all right, let's see, question. If I sub the kids tumbler with the dinosaur and want to add a name later, I can do that. Yes, you can. Um, so once again, if you sublimate the dinosaur and you wanna come back and sublimate the name, yes. But at that point, make sure you protect your tumbler press. So if I'm gonna sublimate, I have the dino here and I'm gonna put the name, I'm gonna put a piece of paper to protect that dino so that don't press because it's gonna reactivate those inks. So make sure you definitely do that. All right, let's see. What's the best way to press a 15 ounce mug with the press? I've tried and the images come out not so great, like um, uneven pressure. And it could be. So for one, make sure you're definitely using the mug attachment whenever you go to do it. And then um, with these dials here, sometimes they can get a little wonky. So you can bring one side in more than the other. And that may be what you're doing is that you don't. And it could be if you feel that you're seeing that depending because some I have tried out a lot of tumbler presses. And so some of them, I really see that a lot of that uh, blow out on the end. This guy's got to be one of the best tumbler presses that I have tried. 15 minutes y'all we have 15 minutes to the um that we have left let's see here must must i buy a tumbler press as well as a mug press no so if you get the tumbler press you can press so for example let me try to slide it in here i don't want to slide one let me try to show you really quick hopefully i don't want to reactivate my inks but i think it's cooled down enough yeah so here is, this is one of like the 11, 12 ounce mugs. This is a Cricut one. So I'm not sure what they call theirs. Is it 12? Um, and so I'm going to show you really quickly that we can get it in here. 
so far. The thing about it is, is it's not coming up where it normally needs to. So if you do have a tumbler press, all you need to buy, and you can buy it separate, is the mug attachment. Um, and that's what I would recommend. All right, let's see here. Do you need any special printer to accomplish? Yes. So you can purchase a sawgrass that is designed for sublimation or you can convert an Epson Echo Tank. Um, and there's lots of different brands of sublimation ink, so you can definitely do that too. So let's see here. What's the best temp and time for the neoprene or coasters? I can't tell you off of the top of my head, um, but we do have a neoprene um, coaster no, I don't think we did the coaster, but we did do the mouse pad, and that's going to be those same settings. All right, so I believe that was the last question. So you guys, let's get ready for the giveaway. All right, here we go. If you use hashtag baby, then you are included. We're going to hit that draw button now. And good luck to everybody. Da -da -da -da. This is my favorite part. I love it. You're going to win 42 designs today. I'm so excited. Fabulous 32. Thank you so much for watching us here on YouTube. Congratulations. You are the winner of four, all 42 designs. So if you'll reach out to mel at designbundles.net, let them know that you are the winner for today's Dollar Deal Live. They're going to send you over all 42 designs. They're going to add them to your account. You can start crafting with them today. So congratulations. Thank you all for participating. Um, just to recap, we've got some of those baby milestones. Make sure y'all snag that. We had our super cute baby tumbler here and then of course we had our, our amazing sign once again if y'all grab one today let it be this one i'm telling you you're not going to regret it so i hope you guys have enjoyed this good luck today and i'll see you guys on the next one